$18.99 for this. Can you imagine that? This is $18.99. That's just ridiculous for turkey. It's turkey breast and boneless, I know it, but almost 20 bucks. Ridiculous. One piece of fish is $71.91. That's hard to believe. Holy smolies. 50 bucks for shrimp. 50 bucks for this shrimp. My gosh. Holy smolies. That's a lot of money. Mini seedless watermelons are $8.99 for two of the guys. Two of these little watermelons are $9. That's $4.50 each. Here's the expensive apples. They're, look at $8.99. $8.99 for all your cloned apples. My gosh, they put them in a box. According to the USDA, food prices are expected to rise 3 to 8% in 2024. And if you believe that, I've got some swampland in Florida to sell you because that means on a $10 product, it's only going to go up 30 cents or 80 cents. That's a crock. That's a lie. You know that. Come on, you know it's going to go up a $10 product in 2024. Probably be $12, $13. You know that. But anyways, uh, Today we're here at Costco. We're going to run in there, check some prices. My wife's here. Let's have some fun. Oh, I tell you what. It's a busy day today at Costco. My gosh, the parking lot is just jammed with people today. My gosh. <laughs> it's not even 12 o'clock and people are flooding in here to spend their cash. We just walked in to our Costco and you're just flooded with TVs. There it is. It says Costco on it. Everywhere you look. $4.29, $15.99. My gosh, look at that. It's everywhere. $1,000 there, $16.99 here. Oh my gosh, nothing is cheap anymore. And look at the show in the moon. That's where the prices are. Outer space. My wife is looking for some face cream, and I saw this uh, Volkswagen electric buggy here. Uh, $279. Holy cow, how come we didn't have crap like this when I was a kid? You know, if I had something like this when I was a kid and I was riding it around through the living room or outside, I'd be ramming everything. <laughs> I was a mischievous kid. Oh, these look really good here. Dry roasted almonds, $9.99 for 40 ounces. Seasoned with sea salt, California grown. And I'm surprised that California allows, uh, allows almonds to grow because I think it takes, what, 10,000 gallons of water for one tree out in California. Looked that up one time. It's insane. But $9.99, that's a really good price right there. And here's Brazil nuts. Oh, these are really good. Look at, and they're peeled. $11.99 for a pound and a half. I like this right here. Those are fantastic. Macadamia nuts, they're always expensive. But I, I think this is a good price. I mean, for what it is right now. I'm sure about a year and a half ago, this would be five bucks off. But today, $18.99. My wife is down there. She's looking for her cosmetic stuff. Look at this. And what I need is a razor. Uh, we're taking a trip, so, and then they have the razor blades themselves, $52.99. Now, by the time I get to use all of these, I'll probably lose half of them. And I tried these Harry's, they're junk. They're, they're just pure junk, they, they break. If they fall in the shower, they're broken. And here's a Gillette, these aren't any better. Oh, these are the disposable, and look at the price. That's not disposable, that's just ridiculous. And just trying to find myself some shavers. This is women's stuff. $34.99, $29.99. That's not bad. Maybe I could just use that. Toothbrushes. Now this is, this, you know what? This is probably okay. $14.99. Instead of buying the electric, because buying the heads on that, they're super expensive. And I have an Oral-B. I'm stuck with the darn thing now with expensive heads. But this isn't bad for uh, good toothbrushes there. Just the old-fashioned toothbrush. And good old-fashioned uh, toothpaste, that's Optic White, $19.99. Here's Colgate. This is all we have right here. $10.99, and you get five of these, and they're six and a half ounce tubes. This is a great deal. This and the toothbrushes right there, Colgate, or the, um, the Oral-B. I really like the Oral-B. They're just a better brush. This is your best bargain. I'm going to get rid of my, um, my electric toothbrush. It's just, it's eating up too much money. My wife bought something here and I said could you show me the price what is this uh, what is that Cetaphil five dollars off oh my gosh Good deal. so how much would this be at Walmart hon 15 bucks each 15 bucks each and today and look at you get two of them for 1689 okay so what do we tell the audience hit and subscribe there you go thanks hon oh look at these this is really good too this Avino 
and this is what I buy. My wife buys the Cetaphil, and then I buy this Aveeno, and one of these would easily be, like my wife said, $13.89 at Walmart. These are these are big containers, four bucks off. That's a good price. I like this Aveeno stuff. It's the 24 hour. See, 24 hours. My wife said that she uses this and it's on sale, eight eight dollars off. And I don't know what it's for, but it's eight bucks off, $28.99. Uh, three times better absorption. I don't. I really don't know what it's for. Cardiologist recommended, but. Uh, she bought one of those. They actually have the Tide Pods on sale, twenty dollars and ninety-nine cents, five dollars and forty cents off, and you get hundred and four of them in here. So that's that's pretty good. Look at that, the pods, because people are asking about the pods and uh, four and one with Downy, and uh, twenty ninety-nine. It's on sale. It's probably uh, more than it was three years ago, but right now that's all we can do. Let's check out their chicken prices. Their drumsticks here, ninety-nine cents, and I really like the. The, the chicken drumsticks here. I like how they package them. See this? You can cut each one of these individually and, and freeze it or put it in the fridge instead of where you get it at Sam's. I still like the price at Sam's, but these are very convenient to um, to use at home. Chicken drumsticks, 99 cents a pound. And um, look at all the drum. There's a ton of drumsticks. Now the thighs. And these are boneless, skinless fries, $2.99 a pound. Well, $28, but you know, that's what it takes because they're doing all the labor for you taking the skin and deboning them and we're the ones with the skin on chicken thighs because I bought a big package a buck 49 they're a dollar 38 at at Sam's hatched raised and harvested in the USA that doesn't say oh it says no hormones no steroids I don't believe that part I don't believe that part either but see they're all individually wrapped that's what I like about this stuff this is what they do at Costco I, I like it better than Sam's, and the price, hardly any difference. Now, they have some really nice cheese here, and this Kirkland right here, uh, Pecorino Romano, eleven forty nine. Remember, that's a pound, so this is $21, almost two pounds right here. It looks really good, and here's some aged Parmesan right here, and um, how much a pound? Six fifty nine. This is eleven forty. This is really good, too. I really like that. My gosh, they really have some good-looking cheese here. I like it. I really like it. And what is this? This is Panner cheese, Indian cheese, eleven forty-nine, and that's per unit. I don't, I don't know what this is. If anybody knows about it, here's some blue cheese here, crumbly. Look at that for salads, five twenty-nine a pound. And I really do like blue cheese on a salad. This is seven ninety-nine for this whole thing. I really like that, but. Uh, Belgosio, if I got that right. Italian Belgosio. $5.29 a pound. That's not bad. And the provolone here, natural cheese. 32 ounces right here. More natural cheese. Crafted in Wisconsin. Not far from Michigan. And get it back in there, buddy. <laughs> Nine, $9.79 a pound. Oh, it's it's actually the whole package. The whole package. That's a deal, I think. And there's salmon here, but this is farm raised. $9.99 a pound. And yep, these are all pen raised, farm raised salmon. And here's your fresh tilapia, farm raised. And where are they from? This one doesn't even say, you know, it doesn't say it at Sam's. They tell you, here's more farm raised, but it's sliced. It looks good. I've eaten enough of it, but it's all farm raised. USA, more farm raised, $10.99 a pound for that. They have a ton of salmon here, a ton of it. And here's some farm-raised tilapia whole. It doesn't say where they where they're from here. It, oh, it's Colombia. That's Colombia. And yep, all. And here's some other ones. Snapper, farm-raised. You have to look for the tiny print. Costa Rica, farm-raised in Costa Rica, six fifty a pound. And tilapia is three ninety-nine a pound whole. Let's check out the crab legs here. Wild cooked Alaskan king. These are the tiniest king crab legs for $22.99 that I've ever seen. They're, they're the small king in the Dungeness. Dungeness, it's hard to get meat off of when I've gone up to uh, Seattle, $9.99 a pound. They're just hard to get meat off. $33 a package. $33 for a package of this. That's not very much. And here's your shrimp. Costco wild caught shrimp. And it's $12.50 a pound, 50 bucks a bag. This is $49.99 for that bag right there. 50, 
50 bucks for shrimp. 50 bucks for this shrimp. My gosh. Holy smolies, that's a lot of money. <laughs> it's a lot of shrimp, but and here's some $9.99 farm raised. Wild caught, $12.99 or $12.50. And farm raised $9.99. But could you imagine that? $27 for the shrimp. But imagine going out to dinner. And here's some white shrimp. These are these are farm raised, $21.99. See, my brother and I would use this for bait on the fishing boat because it's cheaper than buying live shrimp. Five fifty a pound, twenty one ninety nine head on, and they're huge. But look at that—you get what you pay for. They actually have wild sockeye here cheaper than they do at at Sam's, nine ninety nine a pound for wild sockeye, and you get one one piece here, one 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 half of fish sixteen sixty eight. Here's the cod, nine ninety nine a pound. It's more here. It was eight ninety nine at Sam's. But here's a slice of fresh halibut, $21.99 a pound. This is $54, $54 for one slice of fish. Here's a slice of fish for $67. Holy cow. And here's a slice of fish for $71, $71 for, for one piece of fish. Can you imagine that? One piece of fish is $71.91. That's hard to believe. Holy smolies. The red seedless grapes are $7.39. And they're little tiny guys. They're not very big. But the prices. And here's your Victoria Black grapes. $3.99 a pound. They're not very big either. But the price is even bigger than the other ones. And here's your three pounds of, uh, of um, limes. I, I forgot what they were. <laughs> And I forgot my focus factor. That's why six thirty-nine for your lemons. And you know these are all uh, GMO. They're all they're all cloned. My gosh, bioengineered food. Here's the expensive apples. They're, look at eight ninety-nine. Eight ninety-nine for all your cloned apples. My gosh, they put them in a box. Nine ninety-nine for these apple pears. You do get more of them though, the apple pears, but you also pay more. And how much are their peaches right here? Or the pears, my gosh, I'm, I'm all screwed up today. Five, five forty-nine for the pears. Mini seedless watermelons are eight ninety-nine for two of the guys. Two of these little watermelons are nine dollars. That's four fifty each. Golden melons six dollars for one. Golden hami melon five ninety-nine for one. And your cantaloupes are five eighty-nine for two. Just call it six for two or six dollars. You get two of them. Here's the vegetable tray. It didn't have the price on it before. $11.99. I guess if you want to take it into the office or a party, $11.99 isn't bad. But these pineapple cuts right here, two pounds? Two pounds for $7.99? I don't think so. I wouldn't do it. And your butternut squash, two pounds of it cut up, $8.49. That's crazy. That's just absolutely insane. And blueberries are $7.69 for that. $7.69. I thought they were $8.29 before. Maybe, maybe they were in the $7 to $8 range. You know, it's just shocking. 18 ounces. And um, are they even from here? Buenos Aires, Argentina. They come all the way from, geez, that's halfway across the globe. $7.69. No wonder they're expensive. And the asparagus. $8.50 for the asparagus here. But, but you do get 2.25 pounds. And it's awful thin looking. And the price, that's not thin at all. Little fancy carrots here, $5.29. Oh, they're fancy all right. What's the difference? Could you, If you close your eyes, could you tell any difference between these and regular carrots? I don't know. Someone said no, but $5.29 for that, $8.50 for asparagus. That's nuts. Oh, here's these dates again. They're still the same price, $11.99. And whatever these dried persimmons. Almost 12 bucks for these air dried. Oh, jeez. Then your watermelons here, $7.89 for these. My gosh, seedless watermelons. All the way from where? Product of USA, California. Great. Yellow onions, 10 pounds, are $7.50 for the big. They're just regular yellow onions, nothing fancy. Now their butter is $12.99 for four pounds, and it was $14.99 for their uh, butter at, at Sam's. Four sticks unsalted butter, $12.99, or the salted, that's really good, $12.99. It's $2 cheaper than it than it's Sam's. So some things are more here, and some things are less. Organic butter, $12.49. And you, oh, they're four. 
that's two one pounds and here's your Irish um, butter here your Kerrygold this Kerrygold here this is 1449 can you imagine that that's that's insane that's that's really high two pounds of Kerrygold 1449 my gosh ridiculous I love Kerrygold but I don't like the price Oh, I spot it every time I see something that says Rayo, so I have to go after it. $16.99 eggplant parmesan. And look at you get it says two trays in here. Eggplant parmesan. And it probably doesn't say anything about Campbell's on here. Um like oh first ingredient, Italian tomatoes. I like that. Then Italian tomato puree. Really looks good, doesn't it? I mean just from the package, anything that's Rayo's, I like. $16.99 for that four pounds I should try it one day I'm gonna look at some of their chicken cordon bleu $16.99 for this filled with blended cheeses and ham you get two pounds seven ounces of it so two and a half pounds I really like that but $16.99 let's look at some of the beef patties $28.99 you get six pounds of the beef patties but look at them I mean these things are frozen like a rock in and of course, then let's look at the ground sirloin. Twenty-eight ninety-nine for the ground sirloin, one third pound patties. They look good on the picture here. Eighty-five fifteen. Keep frozen. I don't know how they are. If anybody's had these, please comment because they're not they're not vacuum sealed. They look dry. See that? That's dry. Twenty-eight ninety-nine. I wanted to look at this. The the butterball. The butterball boneless turkey breast, four and, a, four and three quarter pounds, is eighteen, eighteen ninety nine for one of these guys. Eighteen ninety nine for this. Can you imagine that? This is eighteen dollars and ninety nine cents. That's just ridiculous for turkey. It's turkey breast and boneless. I know it, but almost twenty bucks. Ridiculous. People buy this fancy water all the time. Smart water, seventeen ninety nine for this stuff. 15 one liter bottles and here's your uh, your Fiji water comes all the way from Fiji 22.99 I heard the people of Fiji they won't they won't even drink this crap 22.99 no way I'm trying to find their silver foil and I, I see the paper plates here 16.99 for this in 18.99 for this right here and and people are buying them up I think they think it's a bargain maybe it is 21.99 for your chinette why are all the packages open you notice that this package is open this package is open nothing is in its place here's some chinette for 19.89 that's fairly light stuff and here's another package here's 21.99 here's another one that's open i don't know why and here's some look at can you imagine that styrofoam right here this is just styrofoam and this stuff is it's 13.49 and here's some something for $9.99. One of these. They're plastic. They're just they're just cheap plastic plates. Oh my god. It says elegant plastic plates. Can you believe it? $9.99. Regular $13. Look at their water prices right here. Kirkland Signature Purified Water. Look at the prices up there. $8.99 and $7.99. Oh my gosh. Oh, they're the eight the eight ounce. They're the eight ounce containers. That's why. Right here. See this? You get the little ones right here. You get the little water containers with the big price. Let's check out the orange juice here. Tropicana. Three of these, $10.99. And two of these organic Kirklands right here are $11.99 with the pulp in it. Uh, with the pulp in it. It's organic. They can't lie. In California, Tangerine, $8.99. It doesn't say organic, but $8.99 for that and twelve dollars for that we'll just call it twelve bucks and get it over with I see something that's really interesting is a plant-based plant-based cheese alternative and um, this is what our government wants us to get used to it's baby bell too plant-based good source of calcium uh, delicious and dairy free thirteen ninety nine for this crap that's what they want us to eat they want us to eat that and they want us to eat bugs let's just check some of the cereals here thirteen forty nine for this Thirteen forty-nine. That's never gone down a price. And why Cheerios? I, I know it's a double box like this, but why is why is this your basic just uh, honey nut Cheerios nine thirty-nine? Why why and six eighty-nine just for your regular Cheerios? Just they're just that's just basic stuff. And then what else do we have? Honey bunches of oats are seven eighty-nine for this. And then this is ten ninety-nine on sale. 
and your special K is is nine ninety nine for this. Nine ninety nine. My gosh. But this is thirteen ninety nine. On sale ten ninety nine. Regular fourteen dollars cereal. Just ridiculous. You can't even get cereal anymore. And it's only going to go up 3 to 8%. I don't believe it. That's all a lie. Pringles, I don't understand it. I mean, this is all uh, just mechanically put together crap, these these chips. $23.99 for this. And uh, my gosh, they're just little tiny cans. But you know what I notice about this? I don't know if anybody picked it up. $23.99, but look at it. Price per each. 666 You don't want to buy this crap. <laughs> no way. Here's some, let's check out some tuna right here. Pole and troll caught tuna, $15.99. Now that's really interesting. So these are probably uh, uh, not line, long line boats, but uh, pole and line caught. Just uh, your local fisherman from Gloucester or wherever I pronounce that wrong. Albacore, wild tuna, $15.99. I bet it's good. Clams, I don't think I'd buy clams in a, I'd, ne I'd never buy clams in a can. Oh my gosh. <laughs> no way no way pink salmon $16.99 in a can I buy this stuff here boneless skinless and my wife told me what this uh what she bought here for eight eight twenty eight ninety nine she said this is kind of like uh your uh fish oil pills so uh she said this is good and it's eight bucks off so here's wild pacific sardines now this is something I'd be interested in nine ninety nine I'd love these guys and this is really good for you too. Albacore tuna, bumblebee. I don't care for the brand, but I do like albacore. 18 bucks. I'm trying to find their silver foil. And the only thing I found was this foil here. Someone said they had it on sale and I can't find it. $19.99 for this silver foil. And then $32.99 for 500 feet of the silver foil. And here's some aluminum foil here. $31.99. I think I'm going to start buying it in this bigger bigger size right here. I think it's a better bargain. Oh, here's something I found really funny. I, I've been looking for a safe, and um, I found one. $299. Waterproof up to seven days, 1,800 degrees Fahrenheit. And look at it. This is, this is, how would you like this? Look at this. I mean, look at this crap. I mean, it's just hanging there. Where do you think this thing is made? China? I wouldn't doubt it. I mean, someone could just knock these these uh the hinges right off there $299 and look at it what a what an example of junk right there my gosh bath towels are $899 right here and um they're $689 100% cotton they look real nice but they're $699 at Sam's and the reason I'm showing you these is because my wife bought some from Marshall's because my brother's staying in, in the spare bedroom and I asked her what she paid for them and she said they were $12.99 and I said are you kidding you could buy a bath towel at, at Sam's cheaper $9.99 for these Martha Stewart well she said they had a design on them I said a design I don't care about a design oh here's some for $6.99 $6.99 for these guys these these don't feel as good as the ones at at Sam's Club they just they just don't these feel these feel these feel cheaper they they just feel real 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 cheap see things are just falling down and i like the white ones because you can bleach them because when i use them when i go fishing but these feel cheaper but 6.99 i really don't care i'm not going to spend 12.99 for a towel and there's some right there 12.99 I, I i don't think i'd ever i wouldn't pay that there's no way that's me that's my price right there 6.99 for a bath towel oh that's a bath sheet and that's a bath towel. So this must be some monster size sheet, 35 by 70. And these are 30 by 58. I'll still take this 699 one. It's okay. What'd you find, hon? What is this? Cranberry pistachio biscuit. Well, are you eating all the free samples? And let me ask you, what's the price on this stuff? 690. 690. Did you buy it just for the yeah, container? One. <laughs> you did, didn't you? Just say yes. There you go. Yeah. Thanks, hon. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Well, that's going to wrap up the shopping trip today. We only got two items, which I'm really happy about. My wife was with me, and we're going to pick my brother up at the airport for our uh, trip to Miami. So I hope everybody enjoyed the show. Give me a thumbs up for like. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Until next time, this is Scott with The Real Economy. We'll see you.